board communications. Does anyone have any board communications? I do. Kathleen yeah. Community Council met last month in an open meeting with parents to discuss the board of practices in general and in our school district. And while we only had two, an hour and a half or two hours, and really the board of practices is two days of training, um, it was a really good introduction to what that is and what that could look like in our district. Um, so that was a great discussion. And then we are looking forward to meetings next year and uh, continuing to bring these kind of topics to board meetings. Thank you. Um, I would just want to mention that um, I went to the 100th birthday party for the Brillies um, a couple weeks ago. And I don't, I, I, it was a tremendous turnout from not just our community, but people all over that have um, experienced the Brillie. I heard people in to, to celebrate this occasion. Um, they had hundreds of people there. It was just a really cool testament to how deeply that environment impacts students, not just when they're there, but three days into the class. Um, they had you know, a lot of their artists in residences there that um, often work with our Brillie students. Um, they had just so many of the people who have in the building through the years come out um, and they just kind of like everyone used to say they would love being part of the building and so I just it was a really fun event and a really great way to celebrate um, something that is definitely a really fine thing about our district so I really commend those teachers and everyone who works out there for putting on an amazing event I can't help but add because as you mentioned people flew in for this that um, one of my daughter's best friends from Good Lily flew in just for the weekend Switzerland for that event. So, I mean, that was very important to her and to many who came to that event. Well, then, we could get another Megan Hall school for all of those levels. I'm quite glad she opted against that. So, <laughs> 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 um, one thing I would like to note is just something that's upcoming um, at Forest Hills Central, the high schoolers in the Honors English 20 class. One of their assignments is be TED Talks. And most of the kids do them just for another grade or two within the school and do it. Um, but for some of them, they uh, they apply to do their TED Talk for the community in a thing called FHC Inspires. And that is coming up the Tuesday after Memorial Day, which I believe is May 28th. Um, it's here at the Fine Arts Center. Um, and it's going to be about 30 kids from Forest Hills Central, but they're just absolutely amazing and inspirational TED-like talks. So if you have the opportunity to come and check it out, it's um, it's 